Precision dairy technology use on dairy farms has steadily increased over the past several years. Technologies developed for use in other industries are being adapted, and farmers, just like the rest of society, are becoming increasingly comfortable with these technologies in all aspects of their lives. Today's robots feed cows, and robots can even milk cows with limited human involvement. High-tech sensors can monitor the physiological conditions of an individual cow, allowing dairy farmers to make better management decisions. Feed cost is one of the largest expenses on dairy farms. In addition to being a major cost, overfeeding, underfeeding, or feeding an improperly balanced diet can impair cow health, decrease milk production, and negatively impact the environment. Two different types of precision technology systems are used on dairy farms to better manage feeding and nutrition. Automatic Total Mixed Ration Feeding Systems, or TMR, which mixes and delivers feed and on-farm near-infrared technology, or NIR, which scans and analyzes feed composition. Let's first take a look at the total mixed rations, or TMR. TMR is basically an optional feed mixture which provides just the right amount of nutrients that certain groups of dairy cows need for their optimal performance. These nutrients are cost-effective, balanced, and provide palatable and appropriate amounts of protein, grains, fiber, fat, forages, minerals, and vitamins, which are targeted for different groups of cows. These groups can vary from heifers to dry cows to lactating cows. Utilizing technology to deliver this form of feed can further enhance a dairy farmer's efficiency. An automatic TMR feeding system can mix and deliver feed for cattle several times throughout the day. Rations are programmed into the computer and the automatic feeder mixes the appropriate feed. Automatic TMR feeders have many advantages. They can reduce labor on the farm. These systems also provide more consistently mixed rations to cows, eliminating the potential for human error. Additionally, because the automatic feeder can deliver several batches of feed throughout the day, the cows have a continual supply of fresh feed available at the feed bunk. Having fresh feed available throughout the day ensures that the cows receive a properly mixed ration. It is common for more dominant cows to push lower-ranking cows away from the feed, preventing the lower-ranking cows from consuming all the feed they may want. These lower-ranking cows will eventually come back to eat, but by that time, the more dominant cows will have sorted the feed, eating the most nutritious ingredients. More frequent feed delivery helps the lower-ranking animals receive the nutrition they need for production and health. While automatic TMR feeding systems offer many potential benefits, there can also be challenges to their successful adoption. Challenges include the initial cost of the system, managing the technology, and layout of the barn and feed storage areas. Installing these systems into an existing dairy farm can be a challenge. If the distance between the feed storage area and the dairy barn is too large, automatic feeders may not work efficiently. Now, let's look at the second type of precision technology used in dairy farms to manage feed and nutrition. This is near-infrared technology, or NIR. NIR has been used in commercial laboratories to analyze feed and other agricultural products for years, but NIR technology is a recent addition to on-farm settings. Using a spectrophotometer, NIR measures the reflected light from a sample of food to analyze its chemical composition. The speed of an on-farm NIR is its significant advantage. Traditional wet chemistry analysis often takes a week or more. Laboratory NIR turnaround time can be decreased to a few days. However, with on-farm NIR, results are returned instantly to the farmer, allowing for immediate feed management decisions. Potential challenges to adopting this technology are a relatively high initial cost uncertainty among farmers and nutritionists about the reliability of the technology, and concerns about how the added information will be managed and incorporated into the decision-making on the farm. Compared to robotic milking systems and activity systems, these precision feeding technologies are relatively new and have not been adopted to the same extent as other technologies. Precision feeding technologies are not appropriate for every dairy farm. However, robotic feeding and other precision technologies will continue to gain in popularity as dairy farms look for ways to increase efficiency and productivity, improve cow health, and be more profitable.
For more information about precision feeding of dairy cattle and upcoming programs, please visit the Penn State Extension website.